All right, so the Chapter 5 Season 1 Battle Pass is not that bad at all. In fact, we've got a brand new type of item in it. It's the rocket racing car and some decals and things like that. So that was a first of its kind. But there's also another first of its kind in the Battle Pass that's also kind of hidden. So if we come to the Battle Pass on pages 7 and 8 are the character Nisha. And she has this bright white dueling style skin as well as this midnight duelist Nisha. Very, very solid skins. I love the black and gold, and I also like the pure white and gold. So she's obviously a fencer. She has the duelist foil. Very clean looking pickaxe. But it's this right here that we want to talk about. The foil flex emote. So again, this is on page 7 of the battle pass. So you have to reach level 38 to unlock this. So let's take a closer look. It says on the left, the fanciest way to count your bouts. So it kind of gives us a little hint there in the description. So when I did my first Battle Pass review, I saw this and I thought it was just her doing a pattern of a sword and that's it. So she takes out her duelist foil pickaxe and she kind of swipes it around a little bit and it makes a ginormous zero and then that's it. And she does that over and over and over. So I thought that was just the general pattern that she does. Turns out, however, that there's a hidden function to this, again, kind of teased in the description over there the fanciest way to count your bouts. So this, like I said, is the first of its kind. This emote can count your eliminations. How awesome is that? And I'm gonna show it to you in game, of course. But right now, we're not in a match, so we clearly have zero kills. That's what she's doing, a ginormous zero. So if you go into a game and get one elimination and then do this emote, you're gonna make her write a number one. But how many can it go up to? I'm not 100% sure. You can only eliminate 99 other people in a normal match unless you do squads or something and keep having people being rebooted. But can it even go up that high? We'll have to test. So yes, we've had reactive items before that show your kill counts, but they're normally back blings or wraps even. There's some wraps that tally your limbs. Never have we had an emote that displays your kill count. That is way cool. So let's just confirm that this is exactly what I say it is by going into a match. First of all, though, I wanted to check. Someone said if you do this in the Lego mode, which isn't really out yet as of this video, that it displays a higher number. So let's just try that. Okay, so that's what she converts into. You can't go to her black and gold style. That's her first style, which is the white one. Oh, 24. Is that what that said? 83? Whoa, so it's random with the Lego mode. 75, so that confirms that she can draw a huge number. Let's try a few more. 37, it's kind of hard to see in this background. 58, that's really cool. Okay, well, I was going to get a bunch of people into a lobby and test it, but... After seeing that, I guess I don't have to. We can clearly see it can go way past 50 kills and even up to 80 some. So I still want to see what it looks like in an actual match, especially on the lower digits. So let's go try. All right, here we go. So first of all, I'm just going to do the emote and we can see what happens. And then I'll get a few eliminations and see if it updates. So I'm just going to land over here in the middle of nowhere, kind of south of the Grand Glacier Hotel. Okay, so here we go. Foil flex. And it is a giant zero. Now, why wasn't there any sound, though? And no sound at all. It's kind of strange. I thought it made noise in the locker. Okay, so let's get in a limb and see what happens. I guess I could test it on NPCs as well. Let's try that. Here we go. I doubt that's going to work, but let's see. Nope, not an official a limb. Oh look, an AFK guy, yes! Oh wait, this guy's chasing me, crap! Hold on, we gotta get out of here so we can do our emote. Here we go. Let's do the emote. Yes, it did update to one! That's awesome, I'm not emoting on you, buddy. I gotta do it again just to see if the color changed too. I don't think it did. 
Yes! So it does work. That is so cool. This guy just died too. Oh, I see you in there, buddy. Yes! What? Uh, no way! What a snipe by that guy! There is, I had full shield, full health right there, and full overshield, and that guy just 250 would me to the face. Are you kidding me? What a beautiful snipe that was. So, so I got a second of limb there, but I couldn't show off the emote. Well, now I got to do one more. I got to get a few more limbs. That was a crazy snipe. Holy smokes. Is that a real player? No. Well, that's a first. There's one. I mean, that's 100% a real. He's trying to bait me out. Oh, jeez. This shotgun shoots so slow. Okay, now we're at two at least. Wait, can I drop stuff while doing this? Oh, yeah. This is for trying to bait me out, sir. Doop. Oh, crap. Okay, that had to have been a bot, right? What's that? Eagle eye? Hold on, I gotta see the scope on this. Oh my gosh, that's an AR! No way, I can't do that. Okay, so here we go. We're at three now. That's pretty cool. So 100% confirmed it works. And it goes up with each single elimination. I wonder if you just saw that. Haha! -ha! That might have been a bot. I don't know. But we're at four now. Jeez. Louise. Dude came out of nowhere. Let's do the emote. <gasps> Someone's right there with a. The oh, jeez. Here it is again. I feel bad emoting on this guy. If you're watching this, whoever I am there, I'm not emoting on you. I'm doing it for this video, I promise. So there you go, the first emote of its kind to be able to count your eliminations in the match. Imagine if you made it to the very end game and you're getting some super, super sweat and you do this emote and it shows a zero. If they know what it means, then maybe they'll go easy on you. But also imagine if you're in a game and you make it to the end game and your opponent does this and you see like a 20 or a 30 or something huge like that, I would just hide in a bush and not come out if I saw that. Pretty cool though, the first emote that can track your limbs in a match. So there you go, that's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, a like is always appreciated, and don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.